Hey everyone, this is Katerina Christakos, and today I'm going to give you a tutorial on how I created a children's book, picture book, using Canva. Now, you know that I've been um, talking a lot about Design Beast, but for this, Canva is fine and it's easy, and I'm going to show you what I did. So you log into Canva, and there's a link to it underneath this video. Create a design, and what you want to do is go to Custom Size, make sure it's in inches, and do 8.5 by 11 because that's a standard size for a book. Create new design. So, for a children's book or most books, you're really going to want um, about 100 pages. So the first page, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click text and add a subheading. I'm going to write, this book belongs to and I'll put a line because I think it's just nice if you're if someone decides to give this book to a child they can actually write their name in there and that gives you page one now let me show you something that just happened here see this the purple line in the middle it shows you the middle of the page and that's the middle of the page there too now we're going to click here and do duplicate page and I can click here and I'm going to delete what I'm going to do is we're just going to make up a story. Over here you have elements. That's lots of different images you can use. Okay? So let's say um, the story starts in a playground. And we're going to do this. Make it bigger. Make it bigger. And I'm going to add some puppies in here. So maybe these puppies. And then I add some text. Now you see that purple box? You want to make sure everything fits in the purple box because those are your print lines. Playgrounds are a lot of fun for kids and puppies. Now we're going to take this. It's still with that purple box, right? Now what you're going to do is you're going to copy this page because everything is in alignment, okay? Especially the text. Um, children have fun sliding down slides. Okay, so I'm gonna take this out, I'm gonna take this out, I'm gonna go to elements, um, kids, Sliding, maybe. Uh, that's maybe this guy here. You can keep looking, see if there's anything else that you like. And then I'll go puppies. Enjoy catching frisbees, or let's say playing catch. There we go. Dogs playing catch. Maybe you have a boy throwing frisbee. You play with this, just see what you got. If it's there, great. If it's not, it's okay. And this is what you do. And you just create your entire story like this. And so you're gonna want, like I said, about a hundred pages. Um, there's lots of really cool images in here. It's this one that you can use. Um, one of the things you're going to want to do, especially if you're using these, like this I put together, so that kind of makes it a new image. This one here is a kid sliding down a slide. 
Um, girl slides. You can use this one. Hold on. Let's say you want this guy here, like that. You can do that. He's behind her. If he was in front, you would just click on him. And you can um, you can do different things. Like, let's say you wanted her on this side. You can flip horizontally. I'm going to put her back. But there's so many little things you can do with this. And you can actually create an entire picture book just using this program. At the end, what you're going to want to do is um, you click download, and you're going to want this in PDF print, okay? And it'll download it for you in a zip file, and then actually it would probably just be a, a PDF, and then you just take it and upload it to your um, to your Amazon account. Um, you can also use this to create a cover, so. Go back to templates. Well, actually, let's go home and let's do book cover. And you can resize it to, again, I like. Inches. 8.5 by 11 and resize it okay and they've got templates so let's say kids you can grab something like this one or this one and a day at the park Instead of him, we go back here, elements, uh, kids at park. Take him out, maybe do this. Or Kids Park. Let's do play, Playground. Click on Graphics. That's, there we go. <clears throat> uh, Girl sliding. Nope. Let's do this one. We could do boy playing. Puppies. And as you can see, it's really easy to create your cover. And this is especially true if you're doing this for um, Kindle. Now, let me show you something else here. Let's say
let's say you're going to do this just as a Kindle book, then you don't have to worry about the 100 pages. The 100 pages are if you want to do a paperback. What you would do if you were doing a Kindle book is you would go here, download as PNGs. It's going to put it in a zip file. Um, you'd have all your pictures, and then you'd go to, there's a free program called Kindle Create that you can get from Amazon, and you would just um, create the book in there and then upload it to Amazon from there. And that's pretty much how easy this is. Um, I hope that was useful. I hope it was fun. I hope it gives you some ideas. If you need Canva, click the link below, and have a great day.